Hey, what's up guys? So I got my spy glasses on right now and we're gonna take this for a test run. Then after we do the test run, I'll show you all the particulars, how it all works. But the first thing I wanna mention is this is uh, runs in 1080p HD and these are the best uh, 1080p HD uh, glasses as well as like spy pens. The thing is when you get these like spy devices, even if, if they say it's like 1080p, the thing is it's always like super compressed so, but I must say that these, it's still compressed, but this is definitely better than all the other spy devices that I have. And also the audio on here is pretty good. In regards to the uh, 1080p recording, the thing is you're always gonna get better video resolution, 1080p using a smartphone versus this, but I'll let you guys see, but again, this is the best one that I have so far. And also these are sunglasses. They look a little bit thick. It might look a little bit obvious. I'm not sure, but we're gonna give this a test run, like I said, but also, Later on during the video, I'll show you that you can actually put transparent lenses in here too. So not only are they sunglasses, but they can be regular glasses as well. And just to let you guys know, the camera, I think is right here on this side here. So let's go ahead and order some food. I'm at the uh, car wash here, waiting for my car to uh, get washed here. So let's go ahead and do this. Hey, one thing I forgot to mention is about photos too. Not only does it take photos, but it takes, um, not only does it take videos, but it takes photos as well. And just like I said about in regards to the video, the video plays better than all my other spy devices. The photo on here, I mean, it's not perfect, but it's still better than all of my other spy devices. And I'll take some uh, photos too, so give you an idea about the actual like quality and resolution, okay? Hey, how you doing? Uh, can I get a large soft taco? Uh, how about, oh, sh oh, shredded beef is good. Sure. Sure. Um, and, and a uh, small Coke? For here? guys so I'm gonna go ahead and eat them here just like that I got my coke right here excuse the mess or not not the mess but the noise is all coming from the uh, car wash over here go ahead and put my little bit of lemon on this bad boy right here oh yeah all right let's do this mm. It's really loud in here too. Okay, we'll get ready to go under some low light here. Ready? Bam! the uh, sign here it's definitely windy out here too it's windy I hear a lot of machine machinery going on in there in the car wash and I can actually hear the cars as well oh shoot that's me oh, I forgot let me go ahead and take a quick picture here Right, guys we are out cruise at home now
in my nice clean car. Finally, this car was a mess. So let me kind of give you like a better look what it looks like on me. Again, I think the lens is right here, but we'll go over the particulars and also I'll show you all the stuff that it comes with. Also comes with like clear lenses if you want to change your sunglasses into like regular glasses. But again, you can kind of see how thick it is here. And I'll go ahead and put these on. And there you go. Well, why don't we go ahead and bring this down and I'll show you everything that comes with it and how to work it, how to start recording video as well as take pictures, all right? All right, so here's the glasses again. We'll go over the uh, function button here and how to record video and photos. But let me show you everything that comes with first, okay? So you basically get like a little Phillips head screwdriver here and you also get like some additional screws on here. And this is for basically if you want to go ahead and take out these sunglasses and make these like transparent glasses. And you can see the transparent lenses here. And it comes with a uh, wall adapter here. Also comes with a cable here. Now this isn't a like a micro USB that you charge your Android phones. It's kind of like a little bit different connector. Anyways, you just plug that into here or a USB charger and you plug that in here so you can charge this spy glasses up. Also comes with a SD card reader here, which you really don't even need. Now the thing is, you have a SD card slot in here, but the thing is you have to have your own SD card because they don't supply you with one. And we'll go over this in one second, but also you get like a cleaning cloth here and you do get like a uh, ejection tool here. And this is for the uh, SIM card and I'll show you this in one second. And also you get like a little pouch here. So let's go ahead and go over the actual sunglasses here. Now the first thing is I think the camera is actually on the right side right here and you can see what it looks like in here. The thing is with the control button it's one function button and you do everything with this button here. And also if you look down here, here is the uh, SD card and if you wanted to take the SD card out, you I mean you can use your fingernails or it's easier to use this little ejection tool here. You can slide that right out. The thing is you never have to really take out the SD card. You can just go ahead and plug this in right here and plug this directly into your computer and you can transfer all the photos and videos that way. Now really quickly, here's the function button here. So if I wanted to go ahead and turn this on, I would press this function button down for three seconds and then you'll see like a blue light here. And then go ahead and let go. And then it should blink, red. Okay, so right now you just have the red light on right now. So it's not recording video and it's not taking photos. Now if I want to take photos, I simply go ahead and press on this once and you can see the red light like blink. It just took a photo. Now, if I wanted to go ahead and start recording, I would simply just go ahead and press down for like three seconds, one, two, three, and then go ahead and let go. It'll blink a few times and then it's gonna go off. And right now it is recording. Now, if I wanted to put this on pause and let's say take a photo, I can just go ahead and press this fun function button once, just like that. And now it's on pause mode. So right, right from here, I can go ahead and take another snapshot or a photo if I want, just press it like once. It just took a photo right there. And if I want to resume the video, I would just simply press and hold down for three seconds. One, two, three. Go ahead and let that red light flash a couple times once it goes off. And right now we are re in uh, recording video mode. Now the thing is, if I wanted to turn this off, there's no on or off button or anything like that. You have to do is just press it one time like this. And once the red light is on here, if you don't take a photo or start a video within two minutes, it's automatically going to shut off. So again, from here, I can go ahead and press it once to take a picture. Or if I want to resume, I can go ahead and press down for three seconds. One, two, three. Let it flash a couple times. Then the light's going to go off. And right now it's in video recording mode. And then if I want to shut it off, I simply just tap on that one more time, let it blink a few times, and then it's going to stay on solid red. And it'll stay on solid red for two minutes and then it'll automatically shut off. Boy, I tell you, today is a hot one. I think today is hotter than uh, yesterday.